And the floodlights are shining down on the players already here at the Estadio Benito Via Marine. I'm Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It's Barcelona taking on Chelsea. Well, thanks, Derek. This should be a tight group, so it's vital these teams get off to a good start here. This should be a very competitive game tonight. Barcelona. Mark andre Ter Stegen in goal. Hector Bellerin starts with Marcos Alonso in the fullback positions. Frenkie de Jong plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Robert Lewandowski. For Chelsea, Edouard Mendy starts in goal. Thiago Silva plays alongside Kalidou Koulibaly in central defence. And Goro Conte starts alongside Jorginho in the centre of midfield. And the main threat in attack today should be Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. Opening match day, Champions League group stage, match day one, underway. Really well played pass. And dispossessed. De Jong. Dembele on the ball it's a fine piece of attacking play from Lewandowski and he has teammates to give it to moving the ball effectively save but still a chance and second time around he scores but the keeper left to wonder what his defenders were doing Well, let's take another look at this and from the attacking point of view everything's right the shot across the goalkeeper players coming in for the rebound and there's not much the goalkeeper could do about that he made a good effort on the first one couldn't react to the second and away they go again what effect will that goal have on Chelsea we're going to find out Havertz Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang and a long way out here and no worries for the goalkeeper Frankie de Jong Dembele nicely timed tackle Jorginho and Aubameyang now. And back to Aubameyang. This looks promising. Well, the defending not the best here. Dangerous ball. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. And a time for cool heads. Rafinha. Good technique displayed. Pedri. Bellerin.
Now Bellerin. He read it well, but still work to do. It is now with Jorginho. And the keeper throws himself at the ball. Fancy a short one. Conte. An incisive pass. Well, it's gone in. A goal for Chelsea, who now are level. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Hector Bellerin. Dembele, how about the cross, might take the lead, oh great block, well the goalkeeper dealt with it admirably, Kai Havertz, Sterling has it, Aspilicueta making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. Good tackle, it'll be a throw. Pedri. Marcos Alonso. Intelligent threaded pass here. Kulibali. Jorginho. And great use of the ball to keep possession. Day. Now Busquets. Tempele. Could play it in. High quality defending. And the pass was just that little bit off. Nearly found its target. Tempele. Delivery from Dembele. Well, when they go in, it looks spectacular. When they don't go in, you know the rest. Yeah, it's a difficult bit of skill. And on this occasion, he got it all wrong. Jorginho. Kai Havertz. Cucurella. Oh, a lovely ball. Played into the centre. And he's in an offside position. Marcus Alonso. Lewandowski. Rafinha. This is Robert Lewandowski. Pedri. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. Rafinha. Now Busquets. Tempele. Can he finish? Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire.
Well, here it is again. The cross is inch perfect, just begging somebody to run onto it. And the finish is really well taken, because he judges the flight of the ball, uses the right technique, and then makes such good contact. That's a clever goal. is moving again anyone's guess how this is going to finish 2-1 currently there will be one minute added on at the end Conte Sterling has it well the first 45 minutes have come and gone here in Catalonia well, Frankie de Jong was busy. He was difficult to subdue in the first 45. How would you sum up what you saw from him? Well, he certainly had an impact on that first half, scoring that late goal. But I thought the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. De Jong. Pedri. It's with Marcos Alonso. And a chance to whip it in here. Sergio Busquets. You can sense the threat is there. Well, it came to nothing in the end. And getting the ball forward. Dembele with the cross. A deft clearance. Thiago Silva Mendy Conte and Aubameyang now and I must say that was a very promising attack the alarm bells were sounding this looks interesting Sterling and Golo Conte Pedri Dembele now Bayerin Dembele on the ball could cross it in here a corner will ensue. Who's going to get on the end of it? Able to get a body in the way. Gets in the way once more. And intercepted it. De Jong. Bayerin. Now Busquets. Marcos Alonso. Lewandowski. Rafinha. Usman Dembele prepared to fire. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. Well, the counter chance looks very real. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Well, Barcelona have had most of the ball in the last 15 minutes and have been pressing to extend their lead. They just need to be a bit more clinical in front of goal. Not getting anxious when they have the ball. And Lewandowski waiting. Well, clattered away. And this situation could be dangerous. Has a go. Flinging himself at it, the keeper. then let's see how it affects the match so the corner played into the box disappointing delivery sailing over everyone in the middle Alonso 
unable to get a body in the way. Dembele. And after the cross, a tremendous block. Pulisic. They might be onto something. It could be for Raheem Sterling. Oh, they've done it! A goal for Chelsea who've got themselves on level terms. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. But should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. has been quite the roller coaster ride. Dembele. Now Bayerine. Too much pace on that particular pass. Aspili Quetta. This is Thiago Silva. they get the winner now, these Barca fans will go absolutely wild. What an atmosphere we've got inside this stadium. It's going to be a really tense finale to this game. Well, showing good patience. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Marcos Alonso. Now Busquets. How oh, can they nudge in front late on here? Still could put it away. Lewandowski is in position at the far post. Fairly comfortable in bringing that ball down. And so into the final five minutes. Kai Havertz. And providing width. And disappointing for the players of the centre that it didn't reach them. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Will they profit from this situation? Oh, surely! Well, a really important piece of goalkeeping at this stage. Well, it's such a key moment in the game. That's a really good save. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. This looks interesting. Barcelona have given us away. And Chelsea still knocking on the door in the closing minutes. Can they find a winner? That is that after 90 minutes. They are level and extra time is coming up. So the penalty shootout about to commence and as a player, this is when you have to hold your nerve. And he's denied them from the spot. So lethal in front of goal. And up he comes, doing his best to remain focused. And confidently converted. Oh, a superb save. Can he convert? And the keeper taking care of the situation. Clinical, as always, in front of goal. Mental preparation is such a big part of this. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. It all falls on his shoulders. If he scores, they win. And that is when you need your goalkeeper. You want a pressure cooker, this is it. He must score. Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. And now he knows what's on the line. If he scores, they win. Oh, he saved it!
And he's beaten the keeper. Oh, he saved it. It's all over now. Well, that's a decent save, isn't it? He read the penalty and then was good enough to keep it out. What a finish to this match.